Well, happy Friday morning, everybody. Store in the garage area. Noah Gregson got in trouble and uh, was suspended for a little bit. And then he said, I quit. So there's been a handful of people taunting me. What do you think? Do you think I am a dumb <laughs> I was. Give us your opinion. You're weak if you don't give us your opinion. <laughs> I'm not taking the bait. But I was thinking to myself, um, you know, this is a new world we live in where you give your opinion on something, you get in trouble. Lose your $10 million sponsor. So it's one thing for some of you smart asses to sit on your couch <laughs> like I am, and there's D, there's Lucy. Louie only got one treat because he's been shitting everywhere. So Mama Kim said he only gets one treat. But however, I feel like somebody's been giving him straps and he's been shitting all over the floor. So Louie and Lucy, they only one treat per day now. So anyway, the story in the garage area is this. Noah Graxon uh, is taking a break uh, for liking something on Instagram. Uh, th this is a new world and, and these are the rules. Now, you and I may not like the rules. However, the, these companies that, that give you $10 million, they, they set the rules. So it, here, here's the deal. If you want to stay in the sport, you have to abide by the rules. Now, I want to thank you all for making me feel good. You're like, man, we love you, Kenny Wallace, because you tell it the way it is. Well, hold on. You know, it's kind of like Uncle Rusty says. I just take the knife, and I just barely get to the skin. I never push the knife in. And I do play by the rules. I don't want to hurt anybody, but I do call out things the way I see it. But I'm not mean. All right? So, uh... As far as some of you taunting me, hey, Wallace, give us your opinion. You ain't got a hair on your ass if you don't. You know, it's funny on Twitter, some of these people that taunt me, right away I'll go to their bio, zero followers. You, you know old Elon Musk, he's starting to get rid of those accounts because these are people that just fire up multiple accounts. So I... I uh, I don't want to be mean. It's not that I'm a wimp. I just, I don't want to be mean. I don't, I don't want to press a subject that is, that is a no win situation. You, I'll tell you what, you comment on it. You, what the hell's going on? Loose, Louis hyper in hell today. Probably pissed I just gave him that one treat. Run around the whole house looking for another treat. All right, I think I've covered it, right? You, you talk about the Noah Graxon deal, not me. And here's why. Because it's a no-win situation, dumbass. You, you, you know it. You know, you know it's a no-win situation. So, uh, but I do want to end with this. Uh, I did make a post about two days ago. I do all my own social media, right? I do it all. Everything myself. Um... Uh, I would like to see some of my friends, you know, do their own social media. Now, the reason that my racing friends don't do their own social media is because we are normal everyday people and they will get their ass in trouble. You know, there's kind of a, there's kind of a, a rule. It, when, you, when you are a race car driver, uh, I, I got a friend here in town. He said, I told my kid that he is not allowed to text on the same night he races. Because when things don't go good at the racetrack, what's the first thing everybody does? It's like a habit. You jump on your cell phone, you go, that son of a bitch wrecked me. And you start calling everybody out, and the next morning you're like, oh my God, why did I do that? So uh, social media is very volatile. Will get your ass in trouble. You will lose your $10 million sponsor. 
and your children will starve to death and you'll lose your home. <laughs> that ain't funny because we did watch some, we did watch that happen to somebody. All right, everybody. Holy moly, five minutes. Happy Friday.